It's a beautiful day in the QuickBooks space. A beautiful day in your business place. It's your bottom line, money and time. Since we're together, we might as well say, won't you be my QuickBooks neighbor? Hello, and welcome to today's episode of QuickBooks and More. My name is Beverly Lang, and I'm the Senior Director of Integrated Services at Fishbowl. And I wanted to take the time to go over the chart of accounts in your QuickBooks Online. So let's talk about chart of accounts. What are they, and how do I get to see them? Your chart of accounts is, in essence, the backbone of your company structure. These are the general ledger accounts that are going to be used to help populate both your profit and loss and your balance sheet. So it's imperative that you know how to get to your chart of accounts. So let me show you three different ways for you to be able to see the chart of accounts of your QuickBooks file. Let's take a look. So in QuickBooks Online, you can simply scroll down to Accounting in the left-hand menu and click Chart of Accounts. This is going to bring you to your chart of accounts. It's going to tell you how many you have out of the 250 that are allowed, and you'll be able to scroll through them and see them. The second way to get to it is under the gear, all list, and at the very top of your list, again, you will find the chart of accounts. This will bring you right back to that same screen. The third and the quickest way to do it is to use a keyboard shortcut. Control Alt A for accounts, and there you have it. There's your chart of accounts. So again, that's three ways that you can get to and view your chart of accounts in QuickBooks Online. My favorite, of course, is the shortcut Control Alt A on your keyboard. I hope these tips will help you be able to review and look at your chart of accounts easy and quickly. Until next time, I'm Beverly with QuickBooks and More.